Welcome to Blue Angel Robotics. My name is Emma. In this video, I'm going to show you how to program this robot to say sorry when it hits something. I have installed a stick and a disc like this, so it has bigger area and it's easier to hit. In this program, we want the EV3 moving forward until it hits the pumpkin. First, drag and drop a move steering block onto the programming canvas and select on to turn on the motors. Then go to the orange flow control tab and drag a white block to the programming canvas. The white block makes your program wait for something to happen before the robot continues to the next programming block. In this program, we want it to wait until the touch sensor is pressed. In order to do this, Select Touch Sensor, then select Compare, and then select State. The default state value is 1. It means pressed. This default value is perfect for this task. Next, drag and drop a move steering block to the programming canvas. Change the power value to negative so that the robot will move backwards. The EV3 wants to be polite and it says, sorry. So let's drag a sound block and drop it between the weight block and the move steering block. Click the file name box at the top right corner and click Lego sound files. Then click communication and then select sorry. Here is something tricky. The default value for a play type is wait for completion. This means the program waits for the sound to finish before continuing. If we use this value, the EV3 will continue to push the pumpkin. When it's saying sorry, that doesn't sound very nice. So let's change the play type to play once. In this way, the program will continue to the next programming block immediately without waiting for the sound to finish. When you run this program, the EV3 will move forward until the touch sensor is pressed. The EV3 will then move back immediately and it says sorry at the same time. Thanks for watching. Click the like button and subscribe to our channel if you like the robotics videos. And if you have any suggestions, please leave a comment below. Thanks!